Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm in a very good mood today because the sun's been out shining and it always makes me smile. Sun is shining, weather is sweet. Hey guys, today, a bit of Tesco's. What we've got, well I'll show you in fact, we've got some slow cooked barbecue pork rib riblets. We've got some slow cooked Chinese style barbecue spare ribs. And we've got some slow cooked sweet barbecue ribs. Now, these what I've got price here, right. Your barbecued pork riblets, they were £3.50 for box. Your Chinese style barbecue spare ribs, uh, they were £4. And your sweet barbecue ribs, they were £4.50. Now, we're going to do a mukbang with this. I'm going to just, I'll just cook it all, I'm not messing about. But I'm not going to go full boxes or everything, because if I do, it would take me about an hour. So basically, it's going to be iron protein and all that, 25.5 grams. Right, he does it microwave, uh, 800 watts, it's 3 minutes 30 seconds. We're not doing it microwave, and we're going to do it oven. In fact, I'm not even going to mess about. I'm just going to get them all open, let's see what's inside. And then, we shall get them in the oven. Now, once you get them out of the box, they're in like a little bag. Now, oh, I've got some sauce with you, that one. Because I'm going to box the welder shut. That's got sauce as well. So, right, guys. You get basically a bag of small ribs, a bag of normal ribs, and a rack of ribs. Now, I'm going to get these in the oven. And we'll see how they come out. Give me two minutes, guys. I'll get them on the plate first. Right, guys. This is what we've got. So, there you've got your Chinese style ribs. There you've got your pork riblets. And here, obviously, you've got your sweet and, sweet and sour rack of ribs. Now, what it says is, put them in the oven. Yeah, wait a minute, see how long. Put them in the oven for 15 minutes, then separate them, and then do them another 10 minutes, then take them out, pour sauce on, and do them for an extra 5 minutes. So, we're going to get them in the oven now for 15 minutes. What am I there, guys? I'm sure you will agree. Hey, right, I'll come back in 15 minutes, guys. Well, we're here, guys. I won't have a drink today, but, but Barry, next door neighbour, just shouted out fence saying, Justin, if you're doing spare ribs, you need a beer. So, I'm not, I'm not going to disagree with him because he's, he's, he's always right no matter what he says and what he does he's always right mm, that is beautiful right your riblets guys it's a 300 pack box and they were £3.50 your Chinese style ribs it's a 400 gram box and they were £4 now this four sixty one. Well, four pound fifty. So obviously it's a bit more for different weights in and how much you're getting. But don't forget, guys, with ribs. Pay for it, it's booing. But anyway, I'm gonna enjoy this can of beer, and I'll come back in a minute. Right, guys, I just took them out. There's a lot of meat here. Let me just show you. I'm not gonna eat all this today. Well, I will do, but not all in one sitting. Now, obviously that doesn't need separating. But these riblets and Chinese style ones only separate so. I'm just going to fly through it and just separate them. Doesn't look a lot with it being like all com compact like this, but when you separate them, then you, you realise how many of the bloody is. I bet it's going to fill this drain, in fact, I'll tell you that now. Oh. It doesn't look nice though, guys, and I'm going to admit, they smell absolutely amazing. Right, what I'm going to do now is get them back in the oven and I'll come back to you shortly. If you do like the channel guys, please like, share, subscribe. We do a lot of reviews, food reviews. We also do a lot of touring in that world as well. Different reviews, hotels, street food. You name it, we'll review it. Right, I'll catch you in a bit guys. Guys, these look amazing. Let me show you. Lot of meat here, guys. Right, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put this sauce on there. 
So, go take my scissors. Do that first. Now, the plan is to put it in the middle. When it gets hot, it'll just boost its sides. There's quite a lot of sauce in these packs. Right. Let's just do these riblets and Chinese style ones. Now they were packed. They're this sauce in each box. I thought they were only two, but I've, I've lifted one of the boxes up and then it, it popped up with us. I know one of these has fell out, so they've all, they've all got one. It's like all three's got one sassy each. This sauce smells nice as well. And I want to put the oven, put these back in now for 10 minutes. And then they're done. But it says on box, a lovely aroma. Now, they smell nice now. Now I'm putting this sauce on. It's going to be amazing when I take that smell. I can, oh, I burn my then. It's normally my mouth I burn, isn't it? But anyway. Right, guys. They look stunning. I'm going to put them back in now. And I'll come back to you shortly. Right guys, they're done. Let's just turn that off. Oh my god, that smell is unreal. That smell is unreal. They look unreal as well. Right. Let me just stand you out for two minutes, guys. Put them all on plate, obviously, but we'll put some on. Right, there you blitz. We'll try a couple of them, shall we? And these are your Chinese style ones. I can get it out. I have a funny feeling, guys. These are going to be nice. Like I said, I'm not going to put them all on because there's too much. But we can review them and see what we think, can't we? Because that's what this show's about. Yeah, let's take them to the table. Right, we'll go with Chinese style ones first, I think. Which is these here, these bad boys. Now it's going to be red hot and I'm doing it again, I'm putting it straight in my mouth where I let it cool down. This is why I burn my mouth seven times a week, shooting videos for y'all. That's what it looks like. It smells amazing. It's that sauce I put on, isn't it? Mmm. That Chinese style one is the dogs. It's the dogs. That sauce is amazing as well. In fact, it's all amazing. Mm. It's like basin steak, it's just falling off into pieces. I was going to use my fingers guys, but I'm not. Because it's, it's not very nice for a video, is it? Wow. Wait, let's try these riblets. See if they're any good. Seems to be able to fat on these with bits of being nice. But I don't mind that personally. I'll see if these taste as soft as tender as 
Chinese style ones. Ooh. That's working guys, that's definitely working. <clears throat> a bit hot, but if we'd been in the oven for half an hour, we'd be hot as well, wouldn't we? I forgot my baby's on side. Anyway, let's get to this back of ribs. Look, it just falls off bone. It's Let me just show you how easy it comes up on this. It's unreal. Well, it just, it just it's mad that. Well, it just bones just falling off it. That meat, guys, is out of this world. A lot of people can't eat meat off bone, can they? I can. That was stunning. There you go, so your Chinese style ribs, they were four pound, your rack of ribs, they were four fifty, when you barbecued pork riblets, they were three pound fifty. So all together, what's that? Four, eight, twelve pound. So all this for everything, all three, were twelve pound. Now there's enough here with some chips or a jacket tated to feed three people easy I would say maybe four people so it's like three pound a meal can't knock that no not happening right package wise nice colourful boxes you can tell they're from the same company where they are they all done with pictures price wise it's a winner for me taste voila I'm going to give that a 9, 100% solid 9. I think that's first time I've given, you no, know, it's second time I've given a 9 like I gave one out over there, didn't I? But that, that was well, a lamp, lamp up over there, wasn't it? But that, that was amazing, mate. Get down to Asda. Sorry, get down to Tesco. Why am I saying fucking Asda? Excuse me. Get down to Tesco. Try these bad boys out. It's, it's amazing, mate. Right, thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, you know, drill. And I'm going to see you next one. Look after each other, guys, and let's stay healthy. Thanks for watching.